Welcome back to Good Morning Nashville. Well, an animal almost extinct is now calling the Nashville Zoo home. Davis Nolan is giving us an inside look at the newest addition named Shriner. Oh, it is so cute. Meet Shiner, the one-month-old Bontabach. This is his first day being let out onto the zoo's African feel exhibit after spending the first several weeks of his life in the hoofstock barn getting stronger. And boy, does he look happy to be out there running and jumping to his heart's content. And if you come to the African feel early when they first let him out, you can see him having fun like this. Now, he shares the African feel with zebras, an ostrich, eland, and other antelope species, so he's sort of been the new kid on the block. So most of the animals on the field will notice, but they don't really care. Um, they might go over and sniff him or something like that. They just, you know, they'll take like, like we see you, but you know, you're fine. Um, the only animals that really care are the zebra. And for some reason, as soon as there's a baby out here, they want to chase it. And then it becomes a game because the baby runs because they're not sure zebra are big and they're little. <laughs> so they run and then the zebra are like, oh, this is a fun game. So the longer they run, the more they chase them. But within a day or two, they all got used to Shiner, but they did have to keep an eye on the ostrich. Our male ostrich, um, our male ostrich is actually the dang most dangerous animal out here. So we wait to put him out the, least, or the last. Um, you can see he really doesn't care about much. He's just kind of chilling. The most interesting story about Bontabuck, who are native to South Africa, is that due to hunting at one time, they were almost extinct. They actually were down to only 17 individuals at one point. Um, and there was a farmer that actually was able to corral them all into one pen um, and then breed them. And so now there are over 3,000 of them. Um, so they, but they're all from those 17 individuals. That's all that was left. Um, they had been hunted all the way down to 17. The Nashville Zoo works with other accredited facilities that participate in the Bontabuck breeding program to help ensure genetically diverse population amongst the species in human care. Shiner is the third Bontabuck born at the Nashville Zoo, so they're doing pretty well. For this week's Zoopalooza, I'm Davis Nolan.